Hi, this is Ryan from Pure Vita Fitness here in Lakeville. Um, just coming to you with the tip of the week. Talking to those people who like to just jump on a treadmill five or ten minutes and then jump into their workout. If you're doing any type of resistance training, circuit training, strength training, all qualifies as resistance training, you just stop just jumping on a treadmill. That warms up your muscle tissue but not the joints and ligaments. They're going to be placed underneath stress during the workout you're actually doing when you apply weights or any type of dynamic stress to the body. So quickly what I'm going to do is show you how to do a dynamic warm up, which is better to get those joints, ligaments, as well as muscle tissue warmed up to an uh, upcoming workout of the day. So this is going to be about five quick movements. You can elongate this by looking up more movements online, easy access to YouTube or any other typical exercise websites. Um, so I'll begin over here with the five movements. First one being 15 body weight squats or air squats, whatever you want to call them. Just going to go up and down, placing the hips back, stand up fully, full body weight squat. You can do about 10, so 15 of these. After this, go into a walking lunge for about a 5 to 10 yard stride, reaching, sitting into the heel, chest nice and tall. Reach, sit, stride again, 5 to 10 yards. After that, that's two good lower body exercises, then we'll move on to the upper body. Okay, go down, push up position. We're just going to go nice and easy, 5 to 10 push ups. Again, this can be from your knees for those individuals weak in the upper body or full push up from the toes. Um, next movement we can do is called a mobility squat. You're going to grab your toes, elbows inside your knees, chest up nice and tall. Just lift your hips, lock out your knees, come all the way back down, bring your hips back underneath. Again, 5 to 10, rep five to ten repetitions on these. And then following this, the last thing we can do, get the inner hips, um, inner thighs, five messier squats, nice wide stance, pushing your hips across into a lunge, lateral lunge position or lateral squat position. The weight is placed on my hips, so my hip, thigh, and ankle are in a straight line. You don't want to be inside of that or outside of that too far, put too much stress in the joints. And you're going to stay down here, shift your weight back and forward five to ten times again just to get the inner thigh warmed up as well as the hips. Alright, I'm Ryan here at Pure Vita Fitness and that is your tip of the week.